So a lot of you guys still to this day ask me about the snitch. How do you find the snitch? Because you guys wanna know where the gun runner is. And you guys know if you look at your map, once you find the snitch, you will see the shopping cart and that's how you know where Casey is, right? So where can you find the snitch? Well, take a look. This is what the snitch looks like. So this is the guy that you guys are honestly looking for at all times. This man right here. And what I will tell you guys to find him, I usually look at two locations. If I can't find him there, then I head over to my secret weapon and I'll show you guys in a second what I use. So let's take a look. Where is the first location I use? Well, if you look at the safe house right here, it's actually the 1040 safe house. And then you look right here, it's the Jefferson trade. So just so you guys keep get a good eye, safe house. You come down this road, you go down 12th street and you cut right here. And this is the first spot I always look for him. He's always right here, right? He's always right here. Now, if I don't find him here, I go to my second spot and let me show you where that's at. Now the second place I always check is right here near the Truman safe house. And then if you look right here, there's this outcast lockbox, and he's usually in this corner right here. So you can lead it, come out here, follow this road up through here you'll see this outcast lockbox, and then right in this corner over here is where he's usually at and usually pops up. And it's the same guy that you see right here, right? And when you talk to him, he'll give you a bounty and then he'll give you her location. Well, if you guys cannot find him, there are multiple different locations that he can spawn. Typically what I do is since I do have three characters, I'll log on with one character, I'll check both spots. If that doesn't work, I'll log on with another character. I'll check both spots and then I'll log over with the third character. Usually I find them in this location or I find them in the location I showed you before. Now, if you don't see them, where else can you look to find them? Well, there's actually a website called division2map.com and I believe they also have a Apple and Android version of this. So if you don't find it, you can still look for it. Now, you can see there's a lot of clutter and when you look at this, you're like, holy, this would be way too hard to see it. Well, all you have to do is hit hide all, right? So now we can kind of see where the White House is, where the DZ West, DZ East, DZ South, but where else can we find the snitch? Well, if you look through here, you keep going down, you'll see one that says snitch, right? And it's crossed out. Now there's 42 different locations that they have on this map. Now, when I click it, it's going to show all the locations he can spawn. If you look right here, this is the location I'm at right now. This is right in front of Jefferson Trade. Now, there's also the one that I showed you guys over here, which is, you remember? You have the safe house, you come out and he's in this corner. But you can look at different locations that he can spawn and there's actually 42 of them. So my recommendation is five, find about five of them that you like and then just check those over and over. Now, another cool thing that you guys can do if you click on it, it will say, potential snitch spawn point. But some of them actually have notes that talk about it and some of them actually have pictures. So there are a lot of different things that you guys can do, but this one says buy some laundry hanging out on a line. So there's a, there's a lot of different things that this website does, but it definitely gives you a lot of clues to where you can find them if you're struggling. Like I said, my recommendation is come here, hide all, hit snitch, and then you can look for all these locations pick five of them i know about three i usually use the two that i usually use this is another one i use over here i check on all each one of my characters and i usually can find them and obviously when you do talk to them he'll give you a bounty you don't have to do the bounty all you have to do is click right here and then you can find where sh where this vendor's at and it definitely spawns in different locations but to see that vendor you need to find him so that is an easy guide for you guys. What I'll do is I'll put a link to this website so you guys, there's a lot of things you can do with this website. I did a video fully on it, exactly what this website provides. It's totally free. You don't have to log in, you don't have to register. You can use it without anything. It's 100% free. And what is also cool about it is they also have the New York City map so you can find a bunch of stuff here too, depending on what you're looking for. So if you guys have any questions about this, let me know in the comments. Remember. This is how to find the snitch. If you guys still have questions, well, let me know in the comments. Hopefully I can try to answer those for you, but hopefully this guide was good enough that you guys are good to go. I'll see you guys in the next video, but until then, hey, nothing but skills out. Take it easy, everybody.